Hello all. Welcome to the learning series on SOC, SIEM, and SOAR tutorial series. In this video, we shall understand how to measure the success of a security operations center. Let's get started. We learned how important building a SOC is for your security maturity. Well it is important to measure the success of your SOC setup. There are a few important metrics that can help understand the scale of activity in the SOC, and how effectively analysts are handling the workload. Let's understand these metrics. First we have, mean time to detection. It is the average time the SOC takes to detect an incident. It helps you measure how effective the SOC is, at processing important alerts and identifying real incidents. Next we have, mean time to resolution. It is the average time that transpires, until the SOC takes action and neutralizes the threat. It helps you measure how effective the SOC is at gathering relevant data, coordinating a response, and taking action. Next we have, total cases per month. It is the number of security incidents detected and processed by the SOC. It helps you measure how busy the security environment is and the scale of action the SOC is managing. Next we have, types of cases. It is the number of incidents categorized by type, that is, web attack, attrition, email, loss or theft of equipment, etc. It helps you measure the main types of activity managed by the SOC, and where security preventative measures should be focused. Next we have the, analyst productivity. It is the number of units processed per analyst, that is, alerts for Tier 1. Incidents for Tier 2, Threats Discovered for Tier 3. It helps you measure how effective analysts are, at covering maximum possible alerts and threats. Next we have, Case Escalation Breakdown. It is the number of events that enter the seam, alerts reported, suspected incidents, confirmed incidents, escalated incidents. It helps you measure the effective capacity of the SOC at each level and the workload expected for different analyst groups. I hope the content was useful. Please don't forget to like the video if you liked it. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay on top of all the upcoming videos. Thank you.